Hey there everyone, and welcome back to another commentary video I decided to make. Of course, as you can tell, I do have uh, the Call of Duty video game, which is Call of Duty World War II. Now, I've already had played this game, I've already had wrapped it, and still playing the game as it is. And one of the type of missions I have played on here, which strongly sticks out for me that I have, I had enjoyed, was the one type of um, mission called Liberation. I'm sure everyone has played this, and once I have played it, like, I very much enjoyed it. So, for this type of commentary video, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and click August on this. This is it. We're going to liberate Paris. The French 2nd Armored Division and the U.S. 4th Infantry arrive at dawn. That means we move tonight. Okay, so he already explained that part. So, for this mission here, the whole liberation, which is in Paris, France. Now, I once I had played this game, I was quite overtaken by this type of mission, the way it is, because, like, obviously, you get to play as a spy. And I thought that was kind of cool, considering the fact that I, well, the only reason why that kind of really more drawn and interested, you know, to me about this particular mission, as well, I am, I am a bit of a James Bond kind of a fan, I like the whole coverted kind of operation, and this, however, was pretty cool of, like, you know, me going through this. I haven't gone in through the part of looking for secrets on here, but when I was playing the mission, I was like, wow, this is actually pretty suspensefully cool, but you still have to be careful with it. So I'll go ahead and click on this now, and if there's any kind of theatrical type of uh, intermittence or whatever, I'll go ahead and just keep quiet until that passes, then when it's time I'll go ahead and speak again. I'm not going by regular, it's going by recruit. It's been a week since we took out that train. <laughs> Platoons in the middle of Paris working with the resistance. Rousseau and Crowley have a plan to sabotage the occupation, and that means striking at its heart. Using the documents we obtained from the train, Rousseau and I will pose as Nazi officers to infiltrate the garrison. This way, gentlemen. The garrison is run by SS and Polizeifuhrer Heinrich, and he couldn't find me. Came for my parents and my husband, and finally my son. Tonight, everything we've lost, everything we fought for, will mean something. Tonight, we take back our city. The garrison. Our contact there will supply us with explosives, and when we blow the gates, that'll be your signal to approach. We're counting on you. All right, boys. Let's get ready. These crowds ain't gonna give up easy. <laughs> I figure we can survive Pearson. We can survive anything. I fought alongside him at Kasseri. We should all be so brave. It won't be long now, mes amis. But first, we enter the wolves den. See you there. For a game character, she's pretty cute. So I'm not really doing this professionally, I'm just uh, doing this for the fun of things. So okay, here's the approach of, of this mission. Soon this nightmare will be over. If you're stopped, the cover story must be ironclad. Let's go over it again. You are Gerda Schneider, a military attache. You were sent by Heschbiegel and foreign intelligence to arrange for Heinrich's safe evacuation to Berlin. Take some time to review the dossier. Well, it has been a while since um, you know I've I've done this mission, so I'm going to have a look at this again. Okay.
I'm just looking through this here, so... Well, I'm probably not going to make this, you know, this part of this mission rather perfect or anything, but we'll see how this goes. Again, this is just going to be for the fun of it. Purpose travel documents. Huh, <laughs> that's funny. My ancestors do come from Germ Germany and... <laughs> I don't know a word. I don't know even a word of this. That's just, that's just hilarious. Okay. Uh, commander of the block. Well, the only thing I could do is just do the best I can from here. See how this goes. Okay. Well, guess where, however it goes, it'll just go. All right. This is our one chance. Recruiting our inside man came at a terrible price. You ought to find him and exchange your briefcase with his. Hopefully, he's obtained the explosives we need to blow the gates. You worry too much, Major. That's my job. I'll meet you in front of the garrison when the operation is complete. Who sent you? Herr Spiegel. Good. Whatever happens, once you make the trade, you must maintain possession of the briefcase at all times. I've come this far. I'll be damn sure I'm going to finish it. So, on this game of of Call of Duty World War II... Papers, please. Mm -hmm. So, on this game of Call of Duty World War II, this mission really stuck out for me, because like, I really did liked it. Yep, the ancient part of the swastika. I really enjoyed it quite quite very much. When I, when, I remember the first time when I did play this game, holy crap. Talk about the suspenseful part and the intensity being around these type of Nazi soldiers. It's like, whoa, the set is unbelievable yet kind of somewhat cool yet kind of a little intimidating like good god look at this like I said the, like the game designers had done a really great job with this I find it anyways and like I mentioned before like uh, you know I've always been a fan of uh, of, co of covert uh, of covert ops concerning the fact that you know I even became like a James Bond fan a bit of a while a while back especially like in the 90s and of course, this is as it is. This this is a coverted secret kind of a mission. It's like, whoa, this is crazy as hell. And this was during the time of the Second World War, where you have to try and seek it into the enemy base, try and gather information, whatever, try and get out. That was just that was just really part of the cool times, anyways. Really, really nice set. I have to give uh, you know the directors and designers of this kind of game full credit about this here. And she's a re and she's uh, she's a, she's like a French rebellion, you know, fighting fighting against these guys. Now, of course, what got me interested in in the whole kind of uh, spy missions or whatever is that, well, of course, according to the according to the whole James Bond films. The character James Bond, he is a uh, he's a Royal British Naval Commander, and works for, and he works for the whole covert operation of uh, of England's MI6, which which is military military intelligence six. It's pretty much like a uh, a secret intelligence division, as opposed to MI5, which is military intelligence five, and that's more of a that's more of a, a security intelligence division. So there's a separate separate. Uh, the separate difference, like a separate type of uh, divisions there, and even in England, it goes all the way from MI1 to MI9. Now MI1 through four and MI789, uh, as far as I do know of, I don't think they mention too much in depth as to what they are, but they do mention about MI5 being uh, being uh, you know a, a security intelligence division, as opposed to MI6, it's a military, it's a it's a it's a secret intelligence division. 
like I said, became a fan of the whole Bond series, and that's how I kind of know about these things. Well, considering the fact that in in the United States they have the CIA and the NSA, and since I'm Canadian, my first thought was, I wonder, I wonder if us Canadians have a secret a secret intelligence division, which we do, which is known as Canadian Security Intelligence Service or CSIS or very commonly CSIS for short. It's just a little fun fact for this for the hell of things. Okay, so like I said, I'm not gonna do this game so called perfectly, but you know, this is for the fun of, fun of things as part of the commentary through. Okay, well I'm just gonna just going to try and do it the best I can and have some fun with this. And here we go. I'll say you're just gonna Okay, there we go. Bitte sehr. Ich habe sie hier noch nie gesehen. Was ist der Grund ihres Besuchs? Ich habe Reisedokumente für Polizeiführer Heinrich. Ich wurde darüber nicht informiert, aber ihre Papiere scheinen in Ordnung zu sein. Sie können weiter Fräulein Schneider. Good God. Like I said, the first time I played this level, it was almost like you're in, you're in huge amount of being in, you know, being intim, the first thing that came to my mind was intimidation and suspense. And that's part of the whole covert operations. Like you gotta be really freaking careful of what, of where you're going, what the hell you do. What is that damn thing? I remember, your hmm. contact's name is Fisher. He's wearing a grey officer's uniform. Tell me the passphrase. Berlin. Good luck. Okay, so since I have played this mission before, I have a pretty good, fairly good idea as to how to play this. When I first came in here, it's like, holy mother of freaking goodness gracious me, Captain Kirk, this is ridiculous. Like I said, they the designers have done a really great job with this set when I was you know when I was like looking around here, it's like, whoa. Talk about coolness, yet kind of like really kind of uh, covertly suspenseful. Like, damn, I gotta really watch what the hell I do. Okay, so now I'm gonna go around here. I'm pretty sure every Call of Duty gamer would know who the hell this guy is, so I'm not gonna waste my time talking to him. Unless if I have to trigger off some events, I don't know yet. Yeah, da, 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 da. Okay, let's just gather up some information for the hell of things here. Like I said, I've done this before anyway, so, you know. Oh, wait a minute here. Do I have to talk to a few people just to trigger off some events or something? I don't know yet, but I'll have to see. The cellar is for person unentsprechende Freigabe gesperrt. Yes, buddy, I speak German too. Yeah, thank you. Anyway, I just gotta be very careful here. There we go. So, like I said before, I've played this level before here, so I'm gonna try and just, if I can, cu cut to the chase on certain triggers so we can kind of, uh, so I can kind of get the hell out of here kind of deal. Oh, jeez. Let's see if I can get this guy nailed down so I can just kind of get this done out of the way kind of deal. All right, he's done. 
restez cachés. La Résistance sera bientôt là. Vos camarades sont en chemin. Vive la Résistance. Ok, she's ok now. Alright, excellent. Now I can just get the hell out of here. Ok. If I don't get busted by this guy, but we'll see what happens. Guten Abend. Sie sollten nicht hier unten sein. Die Jungs sind umgehobelt. Man sagte mir, Oberst Fischer würde hier unten im Keller Karten spielen. Haben Sie ihn gesehen? Der Oberst ist gerade gegangen, um ein Treffen vorzubereiten. Er dürfte im ersten Stock sein. Danke für Ihre Hilfe. Okay, good. I didn't have to show my papers or anything. There we go. You stay quiet and keep sleeping. All right. Je suis de votre côté. Qui êtes-vous? Courage. Vous n'êtes pas seul. Battez-vous avec moi pour libérer la ville. Vous avez ma parole, je le jure. Vos camarades sont en chemin. Vive la résistance. All right, now he's all good and he's fine. All right, well now I can just get the hell out of here. <laughs> How about that? And I can just dodge this guy altogether. Now I'm wondering where the hell to go. I don't think that's it. Like I said, once I had first looked at this whole set, my first thought was, whoa, this is crazy as hell. Say, wow, I'm surrounded by enemies and they don't even know that I I am a spy slash infiltrator. Good God, this is amazing, yet it's kind of a little intimidating. Then again, I also have to keep in mind it's just a game anyways. This is the guy right here. Entschuldigen Sie bitte die Störung, mein Herr. Wie kann ich Ihnen helfen? Haben Sie die Werke Valenz gelesen? Ja, das Herbstlied mag ich besonders gerne. Es ist auch einer meiner Lieblingsgedichte. Bitte hier in Lang Fräulein. Okay, now I'll follow him where the hell he's going. Alright, here we go. We must be brief. Are you ready to make the exchange? No, you're early. And I'm late for a meeting. I'll have the explosives in a case matching yours. We'll have to make the swap in the war room. Lead the way. No, they're watching me. Use your cover to get into Heinrich's office on the third floor. From there, you can cut across to the north wing and avoid the checkpoints. We shouldn't be seen together. Go now, and I'll meet you in the war room. Yep. This is kind of cool to me, and quite rather intimidating and suspenseful. Like shit, I really gotta try and be careful here. Okay, so I just need that direction as to where the hell I'm going. It's probably over here, I'm guessing. Oh yeah, it would be up here. Okay, now there we go. Ich kann ich Ihnen behilflich sein, Fräulein. Ja, ich habe Reisedokumente für Herrn Heinrich. Ist er da? Nein, er ist momentan in einer wichtigen Besprechung. Sie können gerne in seinem Büro warten, er kommt gleich zurück. Like I said, they've done a really good job with this game. Okay, so. There we go.
Damn, this is freaking cool as hell. Uh, let's have a look at this. It's probably one of those documents in. Yep, for sure as hell it is. Uh huh. Okay. Well, I've already had read these things before. All of it says that they're kind of suspecting, like, that same guy I was just talking to was stealing these explosives for a different kind of use. So they're kind of doing an investigation. Yeah, and all that other shitty little jazz. Now, I'll see if I can just get out here and. Of course, go here. Go figure. Verzeihung, Herr Kommandant. Ich wollte gerade nur etwas frische Luft schnappen. Ich bin Gerda Schneider. Ich komme aus Berlin, um Ihnen Ihre Reisepapiere zu bringen. Fräulein Schneider? Ich habe auf Ihren Auslandsstudium gehört. Es war in Cambridge, oder? Ja, das ist richtig. Wenn es Ihnen jetzt recht ist, kann ich Ihnen Ihre Reisepapiere zeigen. Da kommen wir noch sicher. Vielen Dank. Danken mir sehr noch nicht, Fräulein Schneider. Oh, no. If you will indulge me, perhaps we can converse in English, as you know I'm sure practice makes perfect. Bitte. Nehmen Sie das Blatt. Have a seat. So, Herr Gruber sent you to arrange for my departure, I am. It was Herr Commander Spiegel. <laughs> Sehr gut. Very <laughs> good. <laughs> One cannot be too careful these days. <laughs> you look so serious. Let us drink. For my return to the Fatherland. The French deserve each other. <laughs> I once made that mistake and now I just oh corrected my it. God! I will miss the cuisine. Take the Ortolan. That tiny, delicate songbird. Its eyes poked out so that it can gorge. And then it's drowned in cognac. Yeah, I was going to do with I'm that. I'm not sure what I will miss more. Savoring the sweet flesh. Or watching it thrash to death. Hmm? But there is one thing of which I am certain. Watching your son flail as he drowned under my boot gave me the greatest pleasure of all. This for my comrades. This is for my son. That was bloody good. Okay. Yep, he's done. Alright. I'm getting the hell out of here. I just heard that knock, like, yep, I'm 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 getting out of here. I'm skipping out. Alright. Alright, here we go. Now, since I just whacked that guy, now I'm pretty sure alarms are going to be raised. Do, do, 
Du, 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 du. Die gewünschten Berichte aus Berlin sind gerade gekommen. Danke. Ich werde sie mir schnellstmöglich ansehen. In Ordnung. Schnapp den Spion! Was hat das zu bedeuten? Es fehlt Sprengstoff aus dem Munitionslager. Get, get out of there, get out of there quick. Get out of there quick. Nope, nothing wrong, nothing to see, nothing wrong. Everything's all good. Okay, no. Get the hell out of there. Pardon me, thank you very much, appreciate that. Okay. Alright, here we go. Oh, this douche nut. Geben Sie mir sofort Ihre Papiere. Ist das Blut an Ihrem Arm? Ich fürchte, das ist Tinte. Heute ist einer dieser Tage. Legen Sie Ihre Aktentasche zur Inspektion auf den Tisch. Die Tasche wurde unten überprüft. Fräulein, Ihre Tasche! Sofort! Yep, you got the point. Okay, no one around me. Okay, good. Let's get the hell in here real, real, real quick, like. You never disappoint. We've been compromised. The whole bloody place is on alert. They captured our contact. Tell me you made the switch. Yes, I have the explosives. Then we're staying on mission. We'll rendezvous in the courtyard after you plant the charges. Have to be quiet. <laughs> yep, James Bond style. Although, unfortunately, that's not a Walter. That's not a Walter PPK. All right, now I have to get the hell out of here. Crouch down. This is where it gets fun and interesting. Hold on a second, here, guys. Just in case, if I might be running out of time on this kind of video here, this this is gonna be a part two. I will try a bit, try if I can make a part three. Anyways, just stay on course with me.